barbershop conversation, guys. Feel free to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to join Patreon. So Earl Spence responds to why he hasn't posted any videos, why uh, he hasn't been more vocal on social media, and he says basically the truth. You know, if it wasn't for the if it wasn't for boxing, I wouldn't even have a social media account. You understand what I'm saying? I but because of the sport I'm in, I'm a very pop. I mean, he's a very quiet person, and and I would agree. Earl Spence is a very polished young man. You know, uh, I respect the fact at the end of his Ocampo fight, he thanked all the media. Uh, not me personally. He, he thanked everyone that was there in Dallas. He got into a beautiful, uh, was it a Maybach or was it a ghost? It was either of the two. And uh, he was off going and living his best life. And uh, uh, when he said that, it's true. He's in the dungeon working. And you can totally tell the man is in shape, you know, from um, I'll, I'll talk about Mikey Garcia. I, I have positive things to say about Mikey Garcia. So hold your horses. You know, um, I, I think that uh, from the Fox uh, schedule release to now, he looks amazing. He looks amazing. He looks in great shape, you know, uh, face is well structured, you know, uh, is not like uh, as round as it was at the Fox studio. And he's in the gym working. And and if, if you know anything about Derrick James, his fighters come in shape. If you don't believe me, I, Jamel Charlo was in dumb shape against Harrison. You know, Harrison just had the equalizer. He had a jab, you know, and um, um, it worked that evening. So um, Earl, Spence is, Earl Spence is grinding. And guess what? I can't wait to see him, man. You know, uh, uh, I can't wait to see this fight, you know, so, but um, that's the reason why he says he's not doing it. And we have nothing but to respect that because that's how he moves. You understand what I'm saying? So anyways, man, uh, shout out to Earl Spence. He's in L.A. Um, my friend has a film in the film festival. That's why I, I didn't go down there. And I want to see this Paul Roberson film at four o'clock. So um, it's 340 now here in L.A. I'm about to leave my house and go watch that film. Or go down. You know what I mean? It's like, when I get to my car, I'll decide what I'm doing. But anyways, man, Barbershop Conversations, man, feel free to hit the subscribe button. And uh, I appreciate you guys. I have nothing but respect for them. And uh, we'll see. So Barbershop Conversations, feel free to hit the subscribe button. Talk to you guys soon. Peace.